Hello, Luther community. Today we are joined by Luther alumni and current Luther parent, Chad Christensen. Hello, Luther students, and thanks for having me today, Liz and Claire. <laughs> okay, so we just have a few questions for you today. And the first one is, do you have any early memories from your first LIT that you'd like to share with us? My first LIT would have been in 1973 and I would have still been in my mom's belly at that time so I was born in March so the February LIT of 1973 would have been my first um, so up until the end of high school we probably didn't miss an LIT uh, unless it was for a odd hockey tournament here or there but um, of course, it was just exciting to be in the environment of the old gym and see all the kids and just the, the noise, the, the experience of it all was, those would be the, the early memories that I have for sure of LIT. Yeah, so do you have any memories as a fan and as a player? Like how do those really differ and how does the experience change once you actually get to be an active part of the experience? Yeah, once I hit Luther in grade nine and 10, I was a gopher for the teams. Um, so it was nice to be involved after so watching it for so many years and attending it. And then um, that's a different experience as well. It depends the type of team you get. I had two really great teams in grade nine and 10 that I gophered for and had a great experience there. And then of course, playing in it in grade 11 and 12, um, obviously contributing a lot more in grade 12, but also winning it in grade 11. Uh, those are certainly special memories in my, in my lifetime, but more so than just the games to, um, being at Luther and being involved with so many of the, of the student body to run the tournament and enjoy the tournament. Everyone seemed to get excited about it, not only the players. And, um, I think it's just a really special time around the school and, and it's a lifetime of memories. You don't necessarily remember who you played or how many points you scored. It's, it's more just the experience of it and, and everything that happened that, that weekend that you were involved in. Okay, so do you have any memories from LIT besides the games and winning the championship in 1990? Yeah, of course. I mean, as you guys know, as students, it starts a long time before the tournament, all the planning and, and so forth. As players, we were never really involved in that um, until it came to Blitz Nights. And that started the weekend for for us as students and for you guys as students. Those are those are good times to be around the school and a lot of fun has had those nights and then running into the tournament. Um, there's There's lots of things to really focus on other than the games as well, just in terms of the experience and how loud the fans are and always be always playing in the old gym. Um, it's a gym built for the fan experience and the fans are right there on top of you. Most of the time when you're throwing the ball in from out of bounds, you're standing on the court because you can't get out of bounds because there's people standing there or, or some people selling concessions. Uh, you guys wouldn't know that, but Back then, people walked around with their drink trays and popcorn trays and sold to people in the stands rather than walking out to the concessions. So there's lots of that, just a real close and loud and um, homey feeling to that old gym that I attended most of the LITs at. So. No, oh, of course. So do you have any, like a favorite memory of the tournament that you either attended or played in? Like what is the really big memory that stood out in your mind? Uh, two of my favorite memories, um, just because it's so, has been so rare for a Luther team to win it. Uh, two of my favorite memories would be first of all in 84 when my brother's team won it. Uh, I remember sitting on the front of the stage and him running over after the game. Um, and then, of course, in 90, when we won it, uh, that was a pretty special time, too. Having grown up at Luther, uh, born and raised there, to finally come to the chance to play.
play in LIT and then win it, that was that was pretty special for long-term lifetime memory for me. So, Chad, do you have any advice for the current students at Luther? My biggest piece of advice would be to just really take it all in when you get to experience the tournament. Um, don't get overwhelmed by it. Really enjoy, uh, just enjoy the experience of everything about it. The being with your friends and the fan experience and if you're playing in it enjoy it don't get too nervous you know just have a good time and really create those memories for yourself i really hope next year we can get back in the gym and enjoy some more lits